Okay, same day, different time. Um, oh, I went out to my sister's today. Um, the only member of the family that have left um, to celebrate my nephew's birthday because we knew we still need to continue with life no matter how hard it can be and I just thought that I would introduce our family garden our memorial garden um, it was initially for mum, dad and Angie um, this Angie's angel bushes that the lovely neighbours gave us which are blossoming and a couple of apple trees and so over in the corner is the apple tree that my brother gave me about a week ago um, see if we could save so that will be his part of the memorial garden just need to uh, gravel it Um, my husband's done a brilliant job of, of trying to get it ready. Uh, this part here is, uh, this rose was on my dad's grave originally, on his headstone. My mum chose it for him, um, but then obviously my mum needed stencil for hers when she passed away, so we removed it, but we've, we've decided it's very fitting to put on the gate of our memorial garden of two hands clasping a rose my dad's favourite flower was um, a fuchsia and mums and Angie's were hoping to get roses and now Richie's we're hoping the tree will bud So we can use anything that nature produces to enrich us with life from him. Okay. Just down here is um, a lizard. This is this is a stone lizard, or a wooden lizard that my my brother bought my daughter. It's a bit of an old family joke. Um, Lucy Lizard Heartfelt a Heartfelt joke um, That we That Lucy's placed in the garden today Lucy feels it's a fitting place for it to be um, So that's where it is um, Excuse me I don't feel like I need to apologise for the way that I am. I just think that this is raw and natural. And if it can help anybody, if it can help anybody understand or cope that there are people out there going through the same or very similar things, they can reach out. They can reach out and, ha and get help. Um, there's always help there. My brother didn't die because he wanted to or he needed to. Um, but if you feel that you need to or want to cross over, then there is always hope. There's always hope there for you. Because to be fair, looking at my face is what you leave behind. Um, and you wonder if that's fair or not. If you can get help, is it worth getting? Or is it worth just going? I would say worth getting. 